This was a horrible look. This is the blonde hair look of, I don't know why. I'm not sure exactly why I did that. Favorite memories of the band's early days. Wow. This is a long time ago. Showing my age here. Um, I think probably back when we first started. I think the, the first time when we got together and sang together, uh, one of the fondest memories, because it was kind of like, ooh, we got a sound. We got something there. Uh, and it, you know, as cheesy as it sounds, it was quite magical. My first impressions of all my bandmates. I kind of knew them some way, shape, or form. I knew Justin, I knew JC through Mickey Mouse Club, which was shot in Orlando. So I knew JC, obviously. So, I mean, we were friends. So kind of my impression was, hey, it's cool, dude. Let's hang out. Uh, Justin, too young. I'm not hanging out with him. What do I know about him? But for Chris, Chris and we worked at Universal as well. So he was older. Uh, we were just friends, hung out. The only person we really didn't know was Lance. Lance was the first impression that we were just trying to find out First of all, if he can sing, okay, he sings good, and see if he can dance. So we brought him to Pleasure Island in Orlando and brought him around a club just to hang out with all of us to kind of see if we gel together and see if he could uh, have rhythm. And he did, thank goodness. So good job, Lance. My funniest fan story back in the day. Um, there are too many. Uh, one that's funny, though, obviously that sticks out. We were walking into a hotel uh, uh, floor, uh, and one of our security guards is walking, we're just walking down the hall, and he's like, stop for a second. I'm like, what? I'm like, I don't hear anything. I'm just like, what are you talking about? And down the hall, there is a room service uh, table just sitting there. So she, he walks over, he walks over there. He's like, Shh. I'm like, what? He opens it up and there are two people, two girls underneath the room service tray. And he's like, get out, get out. And I'm like, how did you even know or hear that was there? So that was one of the funny, uh, weird, weird moments of my life going, okay, there's people hiding under tables for room service to see us. Of course, the song that the fans bring up to me all the time is Bye Bye Bye, of course. Especially when I leave, even when I'm saying hello, or uh, saying ciao, or anything for that matter. When I walk away, it's usually, hey, bye bye bye, and I'm like, ah, it's not funny anymore. The hardest choreography that we had to learn, hmm, I think was Pop. Pop was one of them, and I think it was No Strings Attached is another one. One of our performances for No Strings Attached on the tour. There was a lot of movements and weird things that it took a while to learn. The song I love to personally perform most was I Thought You Knew. It was one of our acapella songs. It was one of the first songs that we really ever sang together as a group. So that would be definitely close to the heart, close to the brain. What do I miss most about the 90s? My hair. Not the color, just actually my hair. Because obviously with age it thins out. And then yeah, this used to be darker. This is white now. So that's what I miss about the 90s. Speaking of hair, this is my Ronald McDonald hair. This is when I thought I was cool. Thought, keyword. Horrible. I think we've seen this before. I actually still have this leather jacket, believe it or not, this pleather ugly jacket that is deteriorating in my closet, I think, right now. I think that's it. It's not even shiny anymore. And look at this. This is a one piece. That's a onesie. He's wearing a onesie. But my hair was fine. This would see how thick and nice this hair was there. Yeah. This, I thought I was cool. I had a little blonde streak. A little blonde streak in the hair. Chris had a Jiffy Pop popcorn head. Uh, he has a hat on, but he also had a pineapple head. It was braided. So he called him Pineapple. Ellen DeGeneres is right here. Um, there's Justin. And uh, I have a leopard uh, jacket on. These are cool outfits. The reason why I say they were cool is we thought they were cool. We didn't have a budget because we wanted to look like stormtroopers. And obviously we didn't have the copyright to be a stormtrooper. So when we did in our first performances is we had these helmets and these white outfits. It looks like he's stepping on something, so he's looking down, which is JC's looking down. But we'd rip these off and we'd have clothes underneath them, of course. And I think this is when we opened up, this might have been our first tour, but there was a tour that we opened up for Janet Jackson that we wore these outfits. Scary enough, I still have that helmet. This was a horrible look. This is the blonde hair look of, I don't know why, I'm not sure exactly why I did that, but again, full hair, very nice. Chris, not so much, headband, weird. Lance, still looks like Ellen. Justin, uh, he's got his poofy head. And then there's JC, who started to grow his hair out, which he did look good long, but now it's like really jet black now, I think. Uh, yeah, so that, see, full beard, nice in color, not white. A little more older, a little more not sophisticated looking, but a lot more as far as mature, forget the colored hair. Chris never lost that. And then we had the bedazzle bandana with the lovely braids. That was amazing. JC didn't want to show his hair because I think he was growing it out, so it looked at an awkward stage with more hat. And Lance has blue tips. Need I say more?
Again, with the red hair, this is when I started to grow it out a little bit. I'm not really sure why. Uh, but as you can see, of course, I think this was in the weird stage that I thought I was cool and I wanted to grow out my hair. Now I'm praying that I could grow out my hair and I can't because it takes a long time because I'm old. This is my painter's goatee. I used to like this because I was skinny and I was able to do that. If I did that now, I'd look like um, Chef Boyardee probably of some sort. But look, hairstyles are very nice. The little wet look. Uh, I don't know what that looks like. Justin decided to say, hey, I'm getting older. I'm going to shave my hair and not have curly hair anymore. Like I said, I have the little, see, it looks actually kind of good, except the hair. I don't know what's going on. That's, I think, probably when it started thinning out, just a smidge. And Lance, Lance is looking better. He's not looking like Ellen anymore. There you have it, people.